hello friends welcome to java swing tutorial in this we in this tutorial we are going to see how to use j toggle button as a radio so here we use a button group class from uh, swing package then we will use j toggle button to achieve the required result so on the left side window we are seeing we have two button group one is nationality and another one is sex so in the previous video we saw how a j toggle button maintains two state on and off so in the previous video we used that j toggle button as a checkbox here if you see uh, we are going to use the j toggle button as a radio button so nationality if you see there are four button that is grouped under a button group so you can either select france india america or russia as nationality similarly for sex you can select either male female or other option so here these buttons is acting as a radio so here is the prerequisite first uh, you can watch a wt playlist which is optional but it will give you good hands-on and it will make your life easy with swing tutorials so this is second part that means a single video in this very first uh, uh, swing series so this video is mandatory here we create a frame window and on top of that we will continue all other examples so button group is a swing class this button group is used to uh, group the toggle buttons so the toggle buttons grouped under this button group acts like a radio button that means if there are 10 buttons in a button group you can select one among the 10 so when you select a different button then the previously selected button in that 10 button group uh, will get deselected so we will construct a j toggle button with a caption then we will add that to the button group so you can create n number of button and add it to the button group so you have to make a call to the add method so the add method of the button group and hand over the j button to the um, button groups add method so this will add the buttons under this particular group next to show the toggle buttons we have to make a call to one more add this add method is to it's a containers add method or content pans add method so this will render the button in the frame window so when we have say four buttons added in a button group those four buttons will be added to the content pan separately but out of these four since all these four button blanks to single group you can select only one button so once you select a next button this will get deselected so since it's a toggle button it toggles the state so this toggle is on and this toggle goes off so when you select the new button so in the demo you will get a more picture about it now let's go uh, to eclipse and uh, create this example so what we will do first we will create a button group 
So in this example, we will create a two button group. Then we will add but JTaggle button to each group so that you will see two set of uh, groups. So here is our uh, frame window which was created in the very first video. Then in each video we will change the size and the position of the frame window. So for this demo we resized the frame window like this. So first we create a two button group and you can see that the button group is from JavaX.swing package. So we have two button group, one is for sex and another one is for nationality. Alright, now the group is ready. Now we will add the we will create a toggle button, then we will add those toggle button to these two groups. So first we create a label. So now we are setting up the uh, uh, six button group. So we create three toggle button, male, female and other. Then we are adding this toggle button to the back button group. So this is the six button group. So we are making call to add method of the button group. So the same way we will uh, arrange our nationality button group also. So this is the arrangement for nationality. One label, then four toggle buttons. After that, these four toggle buttons are added to the button group. So we won't add this button group to our container using this uh, content pen. So what we add is uh, actual controls. So here, these are all the controls. That means uh, uh, four toggle button, one label in this. Then there is a three more toggle button and one label. So only these we will add it to the content pen. So that's all here. In the previous video, we saw how to handle the JToggle buttons uh, events. Uh, so you can do the same here. Here I am not going to handle the uh, item event for this uh, JToggle button. All right, now we will run and examine this. You can see there are totally seven button. The first four buttons are grouped under one group, which is uh, nationality. The second one is grouped under button group six. All right. Now, if you see, I'm clicking select. So you can see France is selected. So if I click India, France will get deselected and India will get selected. So it's working just like a radio button, right? That's all here in this video. Thank you for watching. Bye.